deserved it. And I'm going to tell you somebody that's not going to get an apology, and that's Kim Kardashian from Master P. Master P was on the show this year, and the hip-hop mogul stopped by to talk about all his business ventures and also dropped some gems about black entrepreneurship. But while he was there talking about that, I had to ask him what he thought about you know, his brother C. Murder's case, who's currently serving um, time in prison, and Kim Kardashian jumping in trying to help the cause, and whether or not it was helping or hurting. And he had no to give when he said this take a look so recently on hollywood unlocked we had posted that back and forth around your brother c murder and um him uh kim kardashian wanting to help him get out of prison there were I, without all the details people know what i'm talking about what yeah. i saw was you know i you own your relationship with your brother that is yeah. your family it's not yeah. anybody else's opinion of that yeah. nobody else has any right to talk about your relationship yeah. with your family when I saw that Kim was helping, you know, I had reached out to Kim to help me get somebody out of prison. And ultimately, she she said she wanted to help, but she did. And I ended up doing it myself. Do you, was your frustration that the conversation about getting him out was now magnified because of Kim Kardashian was involved and, it, and not necessarily the fact that we've all been trying to get our own people out of prison for yeah, years you know and nobody's I'm been talking you. about it? I think I think it start with us and our family. I love my brother. I'd do anything for him. And we're going to be family. We're going to do this till the wheels fall off. I think my frustration came from that people don't understand how serious this case is. And they think just because a celebrity is coming involved, like with Kim Kardashian, she had stuff, connections through the president, and that's on the federal side. My brother case is a state case. Louisiana is a very different place. And this is a state case. And, and I know Boosie went out there talking on social media, which I love it. I love Kim saying whatever she's tweeted out. But if you're not going to be about it and actually go down there and, and help this man and be a part of this, because the federal system can, cannot help my brother. Um, it's it got to be a state. You got to build relationships with the governor and the judges in New Orleans, in, in Louisiana. And that's the only way that's going to help him. So that noise ain't did nothing but made those people on the other side. Like, you know what, we really not messing with this. And I think that's what a lot of people don't understand. Even though my brother, he just want to get out and I, and I feel, it. but at the same time, man, ain't nothing like your family. And, and, and even after that, you know, I don't know if anybody else did anything else. And so it's like, but the, you got it. That's why I say education is so important. This is a state case, a state case. I don't care if you get on social media and say all this stuff and do this. These people in Louisiana is built different. I was trying to build relationships in the background, like to build relationships with governors and judges. And it just it just messed everything up because now a lot of people are not going to put their neck on the line, you know, for somebody that now it's a Hollywood thing. Yeah, I mean, listen, you know, Kim has done a lot for getting people out of prison. Uh, do we forgive her for this? Mm, you know what? Now, you know, I, I watched this interview and just hearing it back, it, it seems like a, a little bit of a clout chase. It seems like you're using a popular rapper's name. And I feel like when it comes to what she's doing for prison reform, I do feel like it comes from a truthful place. But, you know, there's still room for clout chase. And ultimately, Master P has been there with his brother going through this trial and this these issues for years. You know what I'm saying? So if he is saying what's hurting, what's not adding to it. We got to, you know, you got to take heed. You got to listen. But I can absolutely see from his side of his point of view, what's going on, how it's not helping anything. And he derailed everything he's working to do. Because I know regardless of if you know the history between him and his brother, I know at the end of the day, he wants his brother out of jail. He loves his brother. They have these back and forths or whatever. But it hurts to hear that he was working on something behind the scenes. And this came and derailed it. Yeah, this is a perfect example of why we can't mistake celebrity and platform for expertise. Kim Kardashian is working really hard for prison reform. And I, I do believe also that her heart's in the right place, but she's not an expert. And she just passed the baby bar after like the third time, like last week. And so if, even though you're an advocate, but you have she to make sure. But she passed. Give her her flowers. She passed. Sure. We can give her her flowers there in Los Angeles, but she's not in L Louisiana. And that's the reason why they have so many bars and why the bar is so hard to pass is because there's so much nuance and there's so much intricacy behind the scenes that if you walk in like a white savior thinking that you can help everybody without doing, and listen to this word, due diligence, then it's mm. going to get you in this kind of trouble. An actual lawyer, somebody who's an expert in this, would have done due diligence to find out about what's state, what's federal, what's happening in Louisiana before they ever spoke to the public. So even though her heart's in the right place, 
always make sure you have an expert who actually knows the back end helping you or you can cause more harm than good. And this is a perfect example yeah. of that. Her heart's in the right place, but she needed more help. That's sad. Yeah, and listen, I, one thing for sure is that, again, she's doing great work, but I do agree with you that, you know, When Helping Hurts is a book that I keep talking about that people have to read because just because your heart's in it doesn't mean that your mouth and your nose needs to be in it. You know, yeah. I don't know what's going on with this case, but what I will say, regardless of who's watching this and what you have to say in the comments, Master P has spoken and it's his family. I wish somebody would outside of my family jump in the middle of something that we got going on they ain't got nothing to do with them. I mean, it's almost like one of the women with Tristan Thompson, they had no business getting in the middle of that relationship and neither did you. You know, look, the thing that I will, learn, will say this past year has taught me is that there's so much going on in the world and even in the midst of COVID, there was still so much tea to sip. You know, there was just so much <laughs> tea to sip. No matter, everywhere I went, it was 